Okay, so this is my makeup train case. Um, if I can find the link to it, I'll post it down below. It's pretty large. It comes up to my, well, it comes up to my hip. Uh, it's so heavy, you have no idea. Okay, so it comes with three, like, different compartments. It comes with this top part that you can unclip and it comes off. And so if you don't need a lot of room as I do, you can just use this. But then it also comes with the another top, which I've never used, which you can use and you can put it like this and then you can just use the bottom. So for me, I use the entire thing. It opens like this, obviously. Oh, it's gonna be so difficult for you guys to see in here. And then it opens again like this. So right up the top, I have my tweezers that I use for eyelashes. Another like little tweezer thing for eyelashes and three different lash adhesives. I have my MAC um, powder, which is like a blush-ish thing. I have my Cindy Luminizer and my Betty Luminizer. Um, I also have the Mary Luminizer, but I've been using that lately. I have this cream um, blush kind of highlight stick. My NARS Duo in Laguna and Orgasm in Laguna. My Urban Decay Flushed Palette. And, wait, did I? Urban Decay Flushed Palette. The uh, Mini of a High Beam. Mm. One of, these two are just like small eyeshadows. This is one of my favorite NYX um, little trios. It's in Rock and Roll. And then this is a Victoria's Secret bare bronze, little bronzer highlight thing. I have some random eyebrow things, eyebrow pencils up here. And then this, I have eyeshadow bases. I have a eye base and be a bomb from be a bombshell cosmetics two nyx eye bases a bunch of revlon eye bases in there i'll show you i do have mac eye bases and here i have my smashbox eyebrow duo and i have my elf eyebrow duo and i usually have my anastasia eyebrow duo as well but actually i use that so i took that out the second little compartment down on this side is maybe if I is a kabuki brush here how do I is a kabuki brush a duo brush a little a little so like random little eyeshadows some more eyeshadow bases, some more eyeshadow bases, um, some cream eyeshadow bases, um, the a NYX eyeshadow base, the shadow insurance, some more NYX eyeshadow bases, things of that sort. If you go in here, I use a bunch of my Ipsy bags. I'm trying to reuse. And here I have all of my um, eyeliners, whether they're liquid, gel, or pencil. I have every everything from Maybelline, MAC, um, Urban Decay, Urban Decay, Urban Decay, L'Oreal, and another Maybelline, just a bunch of eye eyeliners. In here, there's another makeup bag. It has all of my like little blush 
My dogs are freaking barking. My blushes, which come like I have hard candy, Physician's Formula, Physician's Formula, Physician's Formula, NYX, just a bunch of some of like big blushes. Some big, big blushes. I have some of my smaller palettes in here, which is one of my Lorac, Lorac palettes. My Too Faced Naked Eye, another Too Faced little booklet. My Anastasia Contour Kit. My Naked Too. Also, I do have a moisturizer. I have a couple moisturizers floating around in here. And I have a mirror that it comes with. Um, just a mirror, which is pretty, comes in handy. I have just some random stuff that obviously is not where it's supposed to be. A random powder, once again, not where it's supposed to be. I have a crown here. Let's. A crown brush, I sh um, what is it called? Eyebrow little kit, which is one of my favorites. In here in another little baggie. I have all of my pigments, loose pigments. Taking that off, I'll be going in this let me get down to the level so in here is like all of my lip products you can't even see there we go all of my lip products where do I start in here I have more chubby sticks um, so I have everything between pop cosmetics elf some Revlon um, what is this be a bombshell Revlon Maybelline just like more chubby sticks. And here I have some lip liners. So whether they're MAC, um, Revlon, Remmel, um, what is this? Um, something colors that's all in here and then I have a bunch of like lip brush brushes and stuff like that in here sometimes so right now the whole craze is airbrush so I have an airbrush system and I use airbrush otherwise in here I keep a bunch of true match by L'Oreal foundation or Amazonian clay foundations by Tarte. So sometimes they live in this little spot. And here I have all my glosses. So it goes down pretty deep. Whether it's Smashbox glosses, MAC glosses, Benefit glosses, um, Squeezy Tube glosses, Stila glosses, just whatever it is, glosses in general live in there. With the OCC lip tars that I have depotted. So all those glosses live in there. In here, I just have some, uh, if I could, maybe I'll just stand up so I can see it. I have um, a bunch of Revlon lip butters. Oh, you can't even see what I'm doing. A bunch of Revlon lip butters with two Maybelline lipsticks in here. Also, I have a bunch more, like, Revlon lipsticks. I have some just regular Revlon lipsticks, some L'Oreal, um, some MAC lipsticks, some more L'Oreal. This is actually one of my all-time favorites, this purple. This purple color is stunning, actually. I 
very much enjoy that for summer. I have MAC lipsticks and then I have um, more Revlon and pretty much anything you can think of at this point. Um, any color that comes to mind is probably in here, whether it's brown or something really bright or just whatever it may be. And here I have all of my favorite NYX Circle uh, lipsticks and some NYX, NYX matte lipsticks. And then here I have some little samples that I got from a PR company um, a while back that I can give to brides if they really enjoy the lipstick that I'm showing them. Um, and then once again, all of just the lips, lip glosses are in here. Hopefully I can get them to stand back up again so they don't spill and make a mess. That would preferably be the best thing. And then it just whoop, slips out like so. Which leaves me in here. And here I have my brush belt which looks like this and has all brushes between MAC, BH, um, Sigma, more MAC, Sigma, um, Benefit, Benefit, Too Faced, uh, BH, just anything you can think of is right here. And this little Too Faced thing, if you open it, it's all of my concealers and my concealer setting powders. So I have everything from e.l.f. powders. Um, oh, this has primers as well. My Smashbox Halo, my favorite thing of life um, setting powder. So I poured a little bit of my banana powder, some right, ran, woo, random concealers, um, what is this? Jane Cosmetics Concealer. <laughs> in what color is this? One's in light. Oh, yeah, one's in light, one's in medium. <sighs> My Glamouflage Concealer. <sighs> An MP Concealer. Just anything. Whether it's primers concealers or um, like setting powders for the concealers. It's all in there. This is my Boletta Studio airbrush kit. I have the cleaner for it as well. I used to have a lot more eyelashes but I used up. I usually buy them in giant packs. My favorite for weddings, for every day, for anybody and anything are the Ardell Demi Wispies, but I also buy them in Wispies and whatever. So these are the 110 Demi Wispies, I believe, or 120. And then I just have some e.l.f. Um, eyelashes as well. I have some beauty sponges, makeup remover wipes, more makeup remover wipes. Um, some spatulas for mixing and scraping, like foundation, concealer, even lipsticks for that matter. I have some of my bigger palettes in here. This, these two are BH Cosmetics. I also have my Urban Decay Book of Shadows in here, which is one of my favorites. Also, um, the Glamouflage Concealer Palette by BH, as well as two other BH palettes. I also have the Contour and Blush Palette by BH and the other two blush palettes. This is the Glamouflage, this is the blush palette. Oh my BH. 
I have um, just some other like little random palettes. This Dior palette. An e.l.f. palette and a Sephora palette. Just like I said, just random palettes that I have accumulated over the years. Then as you go further down, I have just a bunch of reuse, like, um, you know, disposable things. I have these duo, dual-sided um, Q-tips, which are perfect for cleaning up. I have um, just regular applicators, lip gloss applicators, just anything that I can toss when I'm finished with them. Um, what else? Oh yeah, just eyelash spoolies, just all the disposable stuff that you could possibly think of. I have my... Um, little mixing uh, pot. In here I keep hand sanitizer and I keep alcohol um, spray in here. And usually I have a little first aid kit where I have like Advil, Neosporin, Band-Aids, um, just little things like that. You never know if a bride's gonna have a headache or anything that's going on and usually in there I also have some eye drops, things of that sort. So really that is it. That is what is in my makeup train case as of right now. Usually right before a job I throw in my MAC um, palettes, my MAC blush palette, some of my other uh, MAC palettes, my neutrals, my colors, things that I use day to day. I throw them in right on top and head out the door. So it's something I have, you know, definitely accumulated over the years. It doesn't just, don't think that it's just going to come and you're going to have a billion things in your makeup tray case because it does not work that way. This is a lot of time and money put into it. Um, this case itself was, I believe, $120, but I will list it down below as long as I can find it. Other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Please don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, feel free to contact me. Follow me on social media, and I will talk to you soon. Bye!